everyone and welcome to DMP Online tutorial on setting up DMP Online. In this short video, I'll explain how to customize Thunder templates. We will go through about how to add annotations, about how to add sections and transfer customization. Since most users will be responding to Thunder requirements, we encourage you to add guidance and example answer to these. When users are creating a DMP, they will be presented with a Thunder template if one is available rather than the institutional template. If there is information you need to collect that funders don't ask, you can ask institutional section and question to Thunder templates. So you will be able to see the customizable templates, which are the Thunder templates through the admin interface. You will have here the link to the templates you click on the templates and takes you to this window and here you have to click on the second tab which shows you the customizable templates so we'll start with about how to add annotations if you want to provide specific guidance for questions in a founder template rather than theme guidance that applies across them all which we covered in the previous video you can do so by customizing Thunder templates. A complete list of Thunder templates is available in the Customizable Templates tab. Click in the link Edit Customization in the Actions menu next to any Thunder template. This will open the template details where you will see an overview and button to customize face. The majority of Thunder templates have a single face. You can click on the Customize Face button or navigate directly to the relevant tab and add annotation to specific questions. There are two kinds of question level customization. You can provide example answer for a specific question, for example, about the volume, or you can provide guidance specific for these questions that will appear in the panel to the right of the question. Another way you can customize a founder template is by adding a section. So at the bottom of all of these sections, you can see add a new section. And here you can decide which section you want to add, if there is anything specific for your own institution. And once you create the section, you can add the questions which you require to be added here. You can also drag and drop the newly added section if there are more. And you can make it to appear at the top or at the end of the Thunder sections. When you are finished customizing, do not forget to publish your customization by selecting Publish from the Actions menu next to the Customize template. And now we have customized a template. Transfer customization. When a founder template is updated by a DMP online administrator, any customization you have created must be transferred to the new version of the template. You will see a notice in the template list that the founder template has changed since you customized it. Click the link in the action menu to transfer customization. This will copy your annotations and sections through the new version of the template. This is also a good opportunity to review your customizations to make sure everything is still relevant. The founder may have changed questions or sections, so examples, guidance or additional sections may need your revision. Once you are satisfied that everything is in order, click Publish in the Actions menu so the customization will appear on the founder template. So I hope you have enjoyed this video and do not forget that if there is anything specific you wish us to explain, please get in touch with us at dmponline at tcc.ac.uk, subscribe to our monthly newsletter and follow us on Twitter, Facebook and LinkedIn to keep up to date with our most recent work. Goodbye.